What was the great civil rights revolution all about? I think the civil rights movement, often misunderstood, really starts with the founding of this country because those who we call the founding fathers, they stated that we hold these truths to be self-evident that all men are created equal, yet some of them were slave owners. Now, a lot of uh, Afro-American uh, people uh, scorn the founders and uh, don't like to refer to the founding fathers because of that fact that some were slave owners. I give them credit, though, because unlike uh, people in our own time, even though they were slave owners, they were universal in their principles. And they vote a standard higher than the level of their own behavior. And the, the struggle to bring that behavior in line with those high principles was the beginning of the civil rights movement. The big failure of the civil rights movement was that it did not have an economic plank. Mm -hmm. Because while we got uh, access to schools and to uh, hot dog stands and all that, the burning issue right now is economic freedom and economic justice and economic democracy. If you would call a meeting today to talk about segregation, wouldn't nobody come but Louis Farrakhan and David Duke. <laughs> <laughs> but if, if you call a meeting to talk about the money, it would be standing room only and it wouldn't, they wouldn't all be black. No, that's true. Because the money is funny for everybody. Right? For everybody. That's where the rubber hits the road. That's what we've got to deal with. Well, is that what the Panthers were all about? We had strong economic pranks in our program, and uh, we had a direct uh, challenge to the whole exploitation uh, of the capitalist economy. In our in our ten points, we had a point dealing with the economy, mm -hmm. and uh, but we were also Marxists in our orientation, which is like totally economics. 